Hey guys, welcome to another commentary done by Diggity. It has been a furious match between Gauss and Monk, upper right in corner. Monk starting as the pink Protoss, bottom right in corner. We have Gauss starting as the black Protoss. A few chain. Oh, and we see Monk immediately moving out a probe. I was about to say small changes in fortune, and it might have been a reverse score, but right now Monk stands up 2-0 over his opponent, and it looks like he wants to go for proxy gateway play. As the in very initial probe making its way across the map, I assume for an initial assault into his opponent. It's also possible, uh, although I could say that he just really wants to get that early scout. <laughs> Let's see if he reveals this initial probe. Unfortunately, oh, okay, never mind. I was looking for him to maybe go along the interior edge. So I take it back. He just wanted to make sure he got a probe in Gauss's face. Oh, look at that. Probe dies immediately. An attempted manor pylon. It does blockade one mineral field and create a little bit of disruption, but honestly not going to be worth it. So Monk starting off at a disadvantage. I think he was hoping to do the in-base pylon gateway play. But Gauss with a very rapid response and some nice micromanagement shutting that down instantly, which is certainly going to put Monk behind to start and knowing... I will say what the other what the pylon does provide is the pylon allows at least continuous scouting within a certain radius. Unfortunately, it's not a radius that really is going to provide a lot of beneficial knowledge as far as whether it's one gate or two gate. Second probe making its way across. And this is Danger Town actually for Monk. He's dropping a forge first to try to defend this. And we do have a two gate opener and initial scout making its way out. This is just, honestly, this is just folding the advantage entirely over to Gauss for Monk. So I guess Monk definitely wants to see a game four, potentially. This is huge advantage. Pylon behind the lines. Let's see if we do see attempt at pro I could not imagine gateways at this stage. Could see proxy cannons, which would be cute. Never mind. Dropping a forge. What is this? I would say this is a broken replay, but I almost wonder if this is taunt. Oh my goodness, it blocked the probes in. I have never seen that. So this edge of the map is not walkable. And so dropping the forge, actually cutting three probes out of the equation. So all sorts of shenanigans, a gas steal from Gauss though. I think Monk is just making a statement that I don't like the shenanigans. Pylon blockade of the natural expansion as well. More probes making the way out. Forge is going to drop, but the initial zealots have been delayed. Now two cannons at the natural expansion. I think that's in range of the pylon to go ahead and wipe that out, but the gateways have remained silent after the initial two zealots. It looks like they're going to go to work on the pylon. That's disrupting a bit of mining and play from there. Photon cannon should also take care of that assimilator at the main. And I am... Monk... Not really. What throws me off from Gauss here is he's not really capitalizing on this by grabbing the faster natural expansion. Probe's still wandering in. Okay, now he's grabbing it. But this is nutty. A lot of probes remaining idle for Gauss, also cutting into a bit of mining. However, Monk not really in a position to counter. It looks like the cannon did wipe out another pylon attempting to be built. Did wipe out the pylon at the natural. Monk gonna go ahead and grab his nexus. Oh my, look at this. Okay, that is in, vi that, that, well, nope, not in visual range. So cannons could be built behind the natural here. Did it again. Did that earlier and it wasn't what I was looking for. So that, pi okay, that's been spotted. Let's see if there's a response. The Zelt's still wandering around aimlessly right this second. Another proxy pylon being built from Monk. Monk just aggravated is dropping a cannon at the natural. Yeah, he's just saying, okay, if you want to play, if you want to go fisticuffs and throw dirt in each other's eyes, let's do it. This is getting dirty. Forge blockading that out. The Zealot going to have to take down the pylon from this side. I don't think that's going to be in time to disrupt the Nexus. Still no cybernetic score from Gauss. 
Gauss potentially completely thrown off his game. A gateway in the main from Monk. Monk really pulling, pouring on the pressure here. There's a cybernetic score. Cannon was at least canceled, and the Forge is going to drop as well. But Monk, yeah, just saying, okay, let's play. Let's play. Costing him a lot of resources, however, in the exchange. Gauss way up in supply. Up three workers otherwise. The attack force growing in significant numbers. Is able, he's got a big gas advantage. Let's see if it takes a minute for him to gather all these forces. Should start producing Dragoons. He's got a, a sizable lead. And Monk may be sneaking out to go ahead and grab his third. Gas at the natural and the main going to come up shortly. Only has the two cannons to defend. Has zero gateways. A Nexus in the main. Are you kidding me with this? Okay, he is just memeing on Gauss. He's like, I can throw a game. Sorry about that. I can throw a game. That's the statement here. Is I can throw this game and I'm still going to pull out a win. Gateway and Nexus in the main. Maybe going for a proxy Nexus. Bottom left. Very frustrated. Yeah, I think that's aggravation play right there. A proxy pylon upper left. But this is a statement from Monk right here. This is like, yeah, I can drop all of this stuff, drop this entire game, and I will still beat you within the allotted five. Robotic facility and range being upgraded. Nine o'clock Nexus being grabbed. There is some salt in this match, I tell you. Gauss may be going to go for a proxy third himself. The Zealot's marching forward. That should be sufficient to wipe out these cannons. And that should be, I believe that will be game right here. Yeah, there's GG. But a throwaway game altogether with lots of salt all over the place. Woo, that was an angry statement. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Give a like, a subscribe, <laughs> share with a friend. We're going to move on to game four. Gauss takes one, but honestly, I feel like that's a gimme. Appreciate all of your viewership. Thank you for listening.